This is a toad. This is a toad, guys. I'm barely even budging him. everyone welcome to another episode of the fly daddies and today i'm back down here on the potomac river and i'm going after giants again and i got a good feel and i think i can get into one today uh the conditions are pretty good there's some wind it could get kind of windy later in the day but uh the water is real calm right now it's going to get warmer it's it's cold right now it's below freezing there's ice all over my boat but it's supposed to get up into uh the 50s today you know, it's on the river, it's always a little bit colder, but we'll see how it goes. Thanks for watching. I'm still trying to figure out this uh, this tide. The wind's blowing upriver, but the tide seems to be coming back towards me. And uh, it's, it's really messing with the way I'm anchoring and the way the boat is. So, I don't know. I'm gonna give another shot here. All right, there's a fish. Took a while. Finally got one on. All right, starting to get a little worried. I couldn't figure out the, the tide, but it finally started doing something here. Come on up. What do we got here? Got one heck of a hook set on him. Not bad. It's first fish, about five or six pounds. All right. Something's hanging out on here. Something little, I think. Maybe it's just a, a bag or something. Oh, it's a fish. All right, cool. Wasn't expecting to feel much on this thing. What, what is this? I think it's bigger than that last one I got. It's got some weight to him for sure. Yeah. Yeah, this one's giving me a fight here, guys. Oh, he's running right towards the boat, and that's where the anchor rope is. This one's at least mid-teens or higher. Could be a 20. It's kind of old line, though, so I'm just I'm playing them out. I don't use this rod all that often. There's slime. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's at least 20. I gotta get the net for this guy. Come here. Don't you dare get in that anchor rope. Oh, that's a good fish. Oh, man, it's a pain in the butt to get these big guys by yourself. Nice, there it is. That's a start. That is a start right there. That's a good fish. That's a good fish. <laughs> he just burped down. You guys hear that? He came from deep. Hear him burping? His stomach was huge when I picked him up. Right in the corner of the mouth. I mean, you can't get a better hook set than that. And that's a seven knot hook. Like I said, I really was putting smaller chunks. That was just kind of out there for smaller fish just to get some numbers. Uh, let's see what this guy is. Are you serious? He 
it's hanging right at 10, 20 pounds. That's way off there. All right, so I was off a little bit. This guy's right around 20 pounds. Uh, still a solid fish. He's long. And he's, he didn't hit like a champ. Like, I really thought it was just going to be a little guy. And all of a sudden, as I started reeling in, he just he took off uh, and started feeling heavy. But he's a big, healthy fish. He, she, I don't know how to tell the difference. That's a nice blue cat. Oh, he took right off. Cool. We were just uh, swaying because that boat came by slow. But it, we were swaying, but that thing just went down hard, stayed down for a little bit, and then came back up. So I think something was trying to get it. Sometimes that bouncing actually helps it helps you out. I wonder if stripers are running because there's a those boats definitely look like striper fishermen. You usually don't get people stacking up in this area unless there's a tournament. Oh yeah. There he is, finally. Yeah. All right. He's acting pretty heavy. <laughs> yeah. This is making it worthwhile coming down here. And that's fun. Fighting him kind of slow so he doesn't have to burp up all that air. We're fishing pretty deep water back there, probably in the 40s. That's where all the bites are coming from, the deeper stuff. But he's coming up now on his own. Swim into those other lines. Uh, yeah, he's not bad. Current did pick up though, finally, so that's making him feel bigger, as always. But yeah, he's definitely not a bad fish. See him down there. Come on. There we go. All right, what am I going to... Oh, crap, he rolled out. Noob. Get a noob here. Got him. I remember the first time I net a fish. Check this guy out. It's croaking pretty good. I forget what that, the actual term for that is. Croaking and burping. Noisy fish. Man, I was with my weighing today. 13 point six or seven look bigger all right here he is fish number three he's not a giant but he's a fun sized fish that's for sure cool I hope the door not Cool. I'm actually hanging in this spot pretty long. I don't know why, but I am. And it's paying off. That's got a headpiece on it. If there's something on there, he's a good fish. I'm letting him take it. I'm not missing this guy. I think he's on there. Yeah. 
Yeah. That's a fish. No, that's just a heavy, heavy fish, guys. All right, it might have been snagged up on something too, but I don't know, he's big. Ah, oh, that one's not recording either. <laughs> All right, this one's gonna test this reel. This is a toad. This is a toad, guys. I'm barely even budging him. This is a beast. God, I hope I get him in. He is just acting like a flathead, really, just sucked to the bottom. He's not head shaking. He is just a big fish. Oh man, all right. Gaining a little bit. He's just not, not moving much. These big fish will do that a lot of times. He's giving me a little bit, oh, there he goes. Cass Kings do pretty well. I mean, for for the price you pay for them, they do pretty good. This drag's not even cranked down all the way. Oh man, this fish is getting bigger. All right, coming around this side. There's the anchor ropes on the other side. Hope he's not fooling me because he feels really big. Weight. Just a lot of weight on there. I actually have to pump this one. No joke. Said I was monster hunting today. I say that a lot of times though. Usually monster hunting, not monster catching. Please be as big as you feel. He's coming up. Oh. Yeah, he's big. Easily 30. Yeah, swim up river. There you go. What a toad, look at this guy. Come on, a little bit more. This hooked really well though, I'm not too worried about losing him here. Nope. Gotta play this smart, gotta play this smart. Come on. Now he's doing the head rolls. Come on up here. Into the net. Got him! Yes! Guys, this is a toad. This is a stud. Yes. Huh. That's a fish. Whoo. Oh my God. It's a mustad, mustad, uh, Perfect demon circle thing in my jigger. I don't know. Hooked him good though, real good. Guys, look at this fish. Look at that fish. And now there's a fish on this guy. All right. Do I take it? I guess I take it, huh? Yep. 
Really wish that other camera was working, go figure. I'm gonna do some uh, formatting on that, I think. Kind of rushing him, because that other one's in. No, he's not, he's not even tan. He's eater, this is an eater here. Yep, he was just whisker hooked. That's all right. That's okay. And swans. I don't know if you can hear that. The swans make the weirdest sound. That was the hook. It's actually a 10 knot. Smaller than the uh, the Cat Max 9 knot. So good size hook. It's been doing the job. It's good enough for uh, Catfish Dave and. Justin from Kayak Catfish. I guess it's gotta be good enough for me. All right, let's see. Really? 30 pounds. Yeah, it's hovering right at 30 pounds. All right, biggest fish of the year though. Man, this thing's got some strength. Whew. Look at this thing. I can't even keep him from rolling. <laughs> that is a 30 pound catfish right there, guys. 30 pounds. It's worth getting slimed up for. Woo! He is a beast. I lost another one too when I was fighting him. There he goes. It's a good fish. All right. Well, I'm going to put this guy back. I think the lens is all slimed up from him. Sorry about that. I got a big boat coming down my way, though. I got to get this guy back in. He's ready to go. There he goes. Woo. That's going to get ugly. All right, that's gonna be it for this one. Uh, just keep watching though. I got a little bit of a teaser for the next one. I know I call this uh, the day of beasts and those that 30 pounder and 20 pounder, they're good fish, but they're not the beasts I'm talking about. You'll see what, I'm, what I mean in this next part. Stay tuned and keep an eye out for part two. Thanks for watching. Oh my God. Yeah, that's a new personal best. That thing is long and it is fat. That might be a 50. That might be a 50, guys. Look at these fish. There's a hat. Not a gorgeous sight.